Hi everyone, today I'm going to review the book A Little Princess. It's a nice book which is uh, suitable for all ages. So in the story, there is this small girl called Sarah Crew. She's very rich and uh, she only has a father who um, loves her a lot. But uh, unlike most rich children, she's not spoiled and she's very well behaved and resilient. You know? She also loves to imagine stuff. So when she gets old enough for school, her father decides to send her to a boarding school. But there she is bullied by Mrs. Minchin, the headmistress, and Lavinia, a jealous classmate. Sarah makes many friends at school, including the dull girl Emigrad and a small girl who likes to throw tantrums called Lottie. But disaster strikes when on her birthday her father dies. The greedy headmistress, Mrs. Minchin, finds out that she won't get any more money from Sarah's father and she turns Sarah into a slave. The headmistress starves her and makes her work all day, but Sarah survives by uh, making up stories. She has a great imagination, but sometimes she feels very lonely. At that time, her friends, Becky, the maid, and Emigrad and Lottie help her. One day, uh, new neighbors come into the house next to their own. There is an uh, Indian servant and a, a very rich man. They notice Sarah and Becky and feel very bad for them, so they decide to make their life better. They give Sarah new clothes and stuff, and but instead of identifying themselves, they just write from an unknown friend. So Sarah does not find out uh, who those presents come from, but she's very grateful. One day, the neighbor's monkey escapes to her attic, and Sarah decides to return it. When she goes to return the monkey, she casually mentions that she lives in India. Uh, that somehow surprises the rich invalid man. The rich man's lawyer questions Sarah, and she finds out that uh, the rich man is actually her father's lost friend and uh, he had he owed her father lots of money. The rich invalid man had found a diamond mine and he had exhibited it with the help of uh, her father's help. The friend offers her a home with him and she agrees. On the other hand, Mrs. Minchin is very jealous that uh, Sarah is rich again and she is still not getting any money from Sarah and she tries to stop Sarah from going to their house, but uh, she's unsuccessful. Sarah also calls Becky away from that house to become her own personal servant, and she treats Becky very nicely. And Becky is also happy in the end. Thank you.